Piyush, to you first, as we see Rahul Gandhi has outrightly slammed Prime Minister Modi and uh, called him a form of Shakti that the country needs to defeat. So at every given opportunity, the Prime Minister raising this and saying, yes, the country will unite to fight against or fight for Shakti. Uh, we hear him speak in Telangana. Give us more on the controversy around what Rahul Gandhi said uh, during his final leg of the Bharat Jodo Yatra. Well, Amila, he was speaking during the final leg of Bharat Jodo Yatra and uh, while speaking there in Mumbai, uh, in Maharashtra, Rahul Gandhi has, uh, uh, you know, stoked a massive controversy where he said that uh, there is a word called Shakti in Hindu Dharma and we are fighting against that particular thing. After that, after that particular controversial statement, uh, BJP leaders like Amit Malviya, Naren Kohli, Shadat Punawala, they all came out and attacked a Congress party asking questions from Rahul Gandhi as to why uh, he is raising uh, uh, questions over the women of the country, why he is... Uh, uh, giving anti sanatan statements and now prime minister has uh, made a scathing remark against the topic of the congress party where the prime minister has uh, hit out at rahul gandhi saying that uh, uh, indi alliance has declared a war against the uh, women of the country against the shakti which is also uh, known as the goddess in hindu dharma and uh, if they have declared war against shakti we are here to protect them uh, we are here we accept the challenge of indi alliance this is what the prime minister is saying uh, so a uh, a scathing remark on Rahul Gandhi by Prime Minister Modi, uh, where Prime Minister Modi has said that uh, we are the one who have always worked for the welfare of women. BJP government has also given the name of the very point where Chandra Chandrayaan was landed, uh, and the point, name of that particular point is the uh, uh, Shiv Shakti. So Prime Minister is attacking Rahul Gandhi over the very comment which he made in uh, the rally which took place in Shivaji Park. Remember that during that particular particular rally, all the yeah. constituents of uh, India Alliance were present, be it about Uddhav Thakre, Amandu Party leaders, uh, uh, leaders from other political parties of opposition, they all were present. And after the statement which was given by Rahul Gandhi, now BJP is certainly seeking a lot of answers from the top leadership of the Congress Party. Right. Thanks, Piyush, for joining us on that. I'm cutting across to Apurva for more. Apurva, give us a sense of the crowds that have gathered right there at Prime Minister Modi's rally. Tell us more on what he said with, with regards to the word Shakti pointing straight at Rahul Gandhi. Well, Nabila, in fact, uh, it's going to be quite interesting because uh, you see these uh, remarks that have been made, these rather skipping remarks against Rahul Gandhi that Prime Minister uh, Modi has made. In fact, he's gone ahead and reiterated that Shakti is a word that has been time and again in the Hindu Dharma as well being a, a strength of force, a strength of uh, you know, courage and here's a, a person there who has spoken at Shivaji Park where he's going on to say that they're going to be against, uh, you know, Shakti and this is what the India uh, Alliance stands for. That's what Prime Minister Modi's message is also going on. He goes uh, ahead and also slams the India Alliance as well where he says that most of the parties in the India Alliance are for corruption and that they've time and again uh, been looting the states as well, especially in Telangana. He talks about how uh, the BJP there in Telangana has promised uh, that there will be a turmeric board that will be set up, whereas the Congress here, which is the current ruling party in Telangana, they haven't made any, uh, you know, any kind of uh, growth or developmental activities for the state of Telangana. That's what Prime Minister Modi also alleges. In fact, this will be his the third visit. Just yesterday, he was there in Nagarkarnul in Telangana, before that in Hyderabad, and now this is the third visit that Prime Minister Modi is taking to Telangana and, uh, you know, and uh, uh, the state, and he's traveling across various districts there and addressing the public. He's going ahead strongly, uh, you know, uh, targeting the India Alliance as well, and he's slamming them, uh, especially saying that he will also go ahead, if need be, sacrifice his life for the welfare and improvement of Shakti. That's what he says. In fact, he goes on to say it. Uh, that uh, the India Alliance and what they stand for is now finally out and that if need be the BJP and Mr. Modi himself will go ahead and uh, sacrifice their lives for uh, empowerment and protection of Shakti and women.